Okay, this question could very well look more difficult than it actually is. You have a long list of numbers. You have 12 numbers, 12 digits. And they're saying, what is the medium? Or they're, at, they're asking, what is the medium of these 12? And so you, you see this list, 10, 10, 10, 10, 8. And you think to yourself, oh gosh, I have to add them all together. I have to divide. Oh my gosh, maybe they're even going to make me look at the standard deviation. But we're only looking for the medium, which simply means the number in the middle. Now, if you have 12 numbers and you arrange them, and when I say number in the middle, I mean if you arrange them from smallest to greatest, the two middle numbers, or the one middle number, what will it be? Well, let's just take three numbers. Any three numbers, this is the median. Let's take four numbers. The median would be what? Uh, these two numbers, and it would be the average of these two numbers if these two numbers are different. So if ever there's even number of numbers, the median is always going to be the average of the two in the middle if the two are different. If they're simply both three and three, three is the median. Now here, we have 12 numbers. So the ones that are most in the middle are the sixth digit and the seventh digit. And so if we count down from the very top here, we have one, two, three, assuming that y is lower. Let's just actually kill y for now. One, two, three, four, five, six. That could be the sixth digit followed by the seventh digit. Now let's go back to y. Let's say y is greater than 10. Let's say y is 11. Then you have one, two, three, four, five, six. Hey, you're still at 10. So whether or not y is greater than 10 or less than 10, the median will always be 10. And that's the answer, which is simply that because it's a numeric entry.